Hey everybody, this is Crazy V Gaming. Welcome to my channel. Mr. President, we have two names linked to the hostage situation. Arash Karavar and Kasim Javadi. Just give the word. It's time to send a message. There will be no more hostages. Kasim is out of the picture. How long before we get Arash? The team arrived in Turkey a few hours ago. They should be in position shortly. In 1943, detailed information from the Manhattan Project was stolen from Los Alamos by the Russian spy known as Perseus. 1968, Vietnam War. Viet Cong soldiers orchestrated by Perseus attempted to steal an American-made nuclear bomb from a U.S. firebase. Five days ago, while on a mission, we acquired intel that Perseus is in play again and planning an attack on the West. Perseus, the CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. Mr. Hudson, we're all aware of Perseus. We're also aware he's more myth than fact. I mean, personally, I think he's nothing more than the Russian boogeyman. General Haig, allow me to introduce the man I suited to respond to that. CIA clandestine special officer, Russell Adler. He's one of the few people who even come close to capturing Perseus. Uh, Mr. Adler, why should we take this Perseus threat seriously? You don't have to, sir. <laughs> yeah, then a lot of innocent people are gonna die. Why do you say that? Sir, every time Perseus has come into play, it's shifted the balance of the Cold War. And after 13 years of silence, if he's active, something big is gonna happen. Something that will affect the free world. Who do you think approved their last mission? Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Can you stop Perseus? We can, sir. I've already submitted the requisition for my team. Sir, their requests are highly irregular, most likely illegal. If the press gets a hold... What the hell are you talking about? Do you know who we are? Every mission we go on is illegal. Sergeant Woods, plausible deniability is the backbone of our work. Al, we're talking about preventing an attack on the free men and women of the world. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Gentlemen, you've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. There is no higher duty. There is no higher honor. And while few people will know of your struggles, rest assured, the entire free world will benefit. I know you won't fail us. This is Hudson. How long until we have a lead on Perseus? They're about to get started. Adler's in West Berlin. He should be at the safe house soon. Do you trust him? <laughs> I'm not the one you should be asking, Black. What about his team? It's a strong group. 
He chased down Sims, Azalea, even pulled some strings to get Helen Park from MI6. We'll get them Mason and Woods soon. I'm not so sure about Park. She and Adler have that business from before. Of course he wants her there. And the new one. Bell? Well, don't get me started. That's the one we need to keep our eyes on. All right, Bell. We're going back to Vietnam. First time Perseus pinged our radar. It was late January 68. We were a joint CIA SOG task force embedded within the 3rd Marine Regiment near Da Nang. SOG was there to sniff out Soviet activity. When word had it, Russian operatives were active in the region. Perseus had no known presence in Vietnam. That changed at Da Nang. Somehow Perseus knew about Operation Fracture Jaw. Fracture Jaw? That one sure went sideways. We launched out of Camp Haskell. Yeah, I'll never forget that shit. Good. We want those memories. No details too smooth. A face, a name. We're looking for anything that can lead us to Perseus. This feels like looking for a needle in a haystack. In a field of haystacks. Maybe, but that needle's somewhere. Remember, we have a job to do. Information from Volkov confirms our worst fears. Perseus smuggled a nuclear device through East Berlin. We can't be certain of that yet. He hasn't. We found encrypted geo-coordinates with Volkov's nuclear intel. An unpopulated region within the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. An aerial recon run revealed this. I want to know everything that's going on inside this building. We'll need the others for this one. Mason and Woods will join us from Kiev. Bell, you'll infill here with Woods. Mason and I have been standing by for an extract. Park will handle comms. We have no idea how large or prepared their forces will be, so use discretion if you have to engage. It's time we took a peek behind the Iron Curtain. Yes, sir, I'm on it. Hey, hey guys, hit the like button and subscribe for the weekend. You knew the nuke was from Greenlight, didn't tell us! What else are you hiding? Maybe I can knock the truth out of you. You might want to rethink that, Woods. Everybody stand down. This little pissing match isn't going to help us catch Perseus. Why didn't you tell us it was an American nuke? He needed us to clean up his mess. The bastard's been lying to us all along. It's not a lie. It's an omission of fact. That's what you do best, isn't it, Hudson? Manipulate people. Tell them your own version of the truth. There is no truth. Only who you choose to believe. Adler knows all about that. Don't you, Russ? Operation Greenlight. What is it? Tell us everything. Back in 58, the arms race was in full swing. Eisenhower was convinced that the Reds moved on Europe. We couldn't respond quick enough. So he authorized Operation Greenlight, a top secret program that placed nuclear bombs in every major European city. The ultimate countermeasure to a Soviet invasion. In 74, the bombs were upgraded to high yield neutron bombs, capable of terminating personnel without damaging infrastructure. Thousands dying in a flash. You're talking about fucking infrastructure. How's that for civilized? We kill the people, but preserve the buildings. We're trying to preserve our way of life. How long have you known about the missing nuke? One of the green light nukes went offline eight weeks ago. We suspected it was Perseus, but couldn't confirm it. So we saw the photos you brought back from East Berlin. So. There's an American-made nuke in the wild. And once Perseus detonates it, the United States becomes global enemy number one. We wouldn't have this problem if you'd done your job. Kill Perseus in Vietnam. Careful, Hudson. Next time, I might not stop Woods.
We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park, anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and Weaver buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants at Yamatown, I want it more. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. We fought to keep communist aggression in check. After two years in the shadows, chatter as Perseus is about to make another move. We don't know where or when, but we know it'll be big. Our motherland is led by cowards and weaklings. In time, the Americans and their NATO puppets will bring the Soviet Union to its knees. We will break this stalemate, then burn them both to the ground. The Soviets claim Perseus is a rogue element, a threat to us all. Stay vigilant. They never tell the whole truth. Launch control. Sir? Yes, sir. Code word launch authority is confirmed. Awaiting your go order. They sleep soundly at night, knowing they put on a good parade. But they lack the will to do what must be done. Thanks for watching Crazy V Gaming guys, share your views in the comment section below. We're hunting a monster. Forget the standard rules of engagement if we're gonna stop him. 
We're gonna have to get our hands dirty. Stand out. This concludes the exercise. Perseus sends the regards. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Arctic air. Clears the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision at your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. 